welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you how I got ready when I went to my Black Bear concert on Saturday night. It was out in LA. It was so much fun and it was an early birthday gift. Uh, August 25th. Yeah, 15. <laughs> okay, but anyway, I really wanted to show you like what makeup look I did and what I wore, you know, because... I like making these videos, so hopefully you guys like watching them. So yeah, without further ado, let's get on to the video. My hair up, I will... No. Jaden, stop! Jaden, stop yelling! What? Stop yelling! So now that my face is washed and clean, the first thing I'm going to be using is my moisturizer, and this is to just moisturize my face because, you know... I don't want my face to be dry while I'm at a concert. I mean, that's not gonna be fun. I'm going to use my Maybelline Baby Skin or Perfector or whatever it's called. It's just to minimize my pores and to smooth out my face before I put on makeup. <laughs> and I'm actually gonna be taking my Makeup Forever Professional Mist and Fix. And this is actually a makeup primer and setter, so I put it on before my makeup and after, so. I make sure my makeup stays on all day and night. So I am using actually a foundation and a BB cream because I don't like how the foundation looks on my skin alone. So I'm adding it with a BB cream because I think it just looks better. So I'm just applying it with my brush and I actually mixed it like with this brush so that's why I'm applying it like this. So yes, I am breaking out over here so it needs a little more help. And now I'm going to be using concealer and I'm using the Fake Up Concealer by Benefit. And this will just eliminate all of my dark circles and I'm just going like that. And I also like to add the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer with it because I love how they both work together. They work amazing. So I'm first gonna blend it out with my mini beauty blender and then I'm gonna go in with my big one to just speed up the process. See, now I'm taking my big beauty blender and making sure every single spot is blended out. A powder foundation so I can just get that, you know, extra coverage on my face. And I'm just all over my Nail Techniques brush and Honestly, I love this powder because it doesn't make you look cakey, like no matter how much you put on, just like my Stay Matte one from Rimmel, and it just adds a little bit more tint to my face because this is just a shade darker than my actual skin tone. Moving straight to eyebrows, I am just... Jaden, stop yelling! Okay. Anyway, I'm going to be combing them out with this fully and then lightly filling them in at the arch with my Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. This stuff is the bomb. And I barely even fill them in, so they look dark. I mean, because my eyebrows are dark, so nothing I can do. And now I'm going to be doing a very dramatic eye look, so of course I have to prime my eyes. I'm using the Tarte CC Clay Eye Primer. Well, we are going for a very gold, smoky kind of look so this is also gonna take some time so now I'm going to be taking that same paint pot that I used in my last video the everyday school makeup tutorial and it is in my two cents so now that we have our base on I'm using the L'Oreal infallible smokies smokus I don't know what it's called but it looks like this it honestly just helps you with your smoky eye you want to be careful because this is really dark so I'm just kind of making not like a wing but I'm kind of just going like that but trust me I'm gonna blend it out and since some of the paint pot kind of got you know dried out from all the eyeshadow I'm just gonna apply some in the front like the inner corner of my eye to just bring back that gold once again and now I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes to prep for mascara. I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Telescopic Shocking, Shocking Extensions Mascara. And I love this mascara, it's so nice. 
So now I'm going to contour using my Tarte Park Ave Princess Contour Kit. Like, this bronzer is seriously my life. I cannot get enough of it. And I'm, I use it so much, it's amazing. So I'm just contouring down here, my nose, temples. Now I'm going to be highlighting my face with that, with a blush brush from Real Techniques and I think highlighting honestly just changed the whole look completely. Now I'm using my Bobbi Brown lip pencil in rose and I'm choosing this color because since I already have like a really dramatic eye, I want my attention to not be on my lips but on my eyes. And the last step is again to set my face with the Makeup Forever fist and mix spray and now I'm going to be showing you what outfit I wore because I mean I'm sure you guys want to know maybe not but yeah anyway let's see what I wore If you guys enjoyed and like these videos, give it a big thumbs up down below and make sure to subscribe. There's an amazing red button down there that you can hit and you'll get notified every time I make a video. So yes, I'll see you guys next Tuesday. Bye!